Hello everyone, it is time to pick some polishes. Okay, so let's go over here. And this is Zoya Caitlin. So that's the first one. Okay, let's see if we're gonna pair with that. And that is gonna be right here. Ooh, and this is painted polishes, just one look. So painted polishes, just one look, and Zoya's Caitlin. Oh, get a hair tickling me. Okay, so those are the two polishes. Ooh, those are kind of pretty. Okay, huh, all right, okay. So those are the two polishes I picked. I'll meet you back here with a complete Manny. We'll see what I can come up with. And now taking a closer look at these beautiful colors. First up we have Painted Polishes, Just One Look. This is a really pretty polish. It's a soft periwinkle holographic base with a shiny purple shimmer and silver galaxy glitters throughout. And then we have Zoya's Caitlin, which is a mid-tone gray cream. For this mani, I'm gonna start off by painting all of my nails with Just One Look. This is a beautiful curly polish. I just can't say enough about it. I love the periwinkle color and then with that galaxy glitter in it, just absolutely beautiful and glows off the nail. Now because Just One Look is that Crelly formula, I am going to go in for a second coat here. This is going to intensify that periwinkle base and bring out that galaxy glitter and that shifty shimmer in there. This is so pretty. For the design here, I'm going to be using a Moyu London stamping plate and this is from the Artist Collection. It is plate 28. I'm going to be using Caitlin as my stamping polish. It is a more saturated color so it does pick up very nicely. Now I'm just going to take a piece of tape here and pick up any part of the design I do not wish to transfer onto my nail. What I'm doing is I'm trying to line up that smaller triangle towards the cuticle of my nail and then having the two other lines that create the kind of arrow point towards the tip of my nail. And then again with a piece of tape just removing any of that design that got on my finger. Then just repeating those same steps for the rest of my nails. And now to seal in this mani, I'm going to use Believe Beauty's Gel Effects Top Coat. For this mani, I also wanted to use a newer nail art supply to me. I received these in a Fearless Nail Art Box a while back, but I've been too scared to use them. These are really cool kind of diamond shape uh, holographic diamonds. They're really, really pretty and I think they look really good on this mani. I do have to say these were a little tricky to get to actually stick onto my wax pencil to pick them up and then get them to stay on the nail. Once I got them on there, they weren't quite in the position that I wanted, so then I had to fiddle with them. It was a process, let me just tell you, but it ended up working out really good and I am very happy with it. 
And here is my final design. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I think this turned out really cool. I'm very happy with uh, Painted Polishes Just One Look. I think it is an excellent periwinkle color. And then with all that galaxy glitter and holographic in there, so very pretty. The opacity and formula of Zoya's Caitlin it made it a very nice stamping polish. I really like these diamond accents. I think they are very pretty. Please leave any comments or suggestions below and I will see you in the next one.